Hey guys, welcome back to Jared the Journeyman. Today I'm going to show you guys, let me try to get it just right, these uh, expansion joints right up in here. Um, I've had a lot of questions on my Instagram account. Um, if you're not following me there, give me a follow on Instagram. And people have been asking me how those work and what they are. So um, we'll go up there and give you a little look at the expansion joints. And if you guys are liking this hospital series, leave me a like or subscribe and let me know that uh, you guys are, are digging what I'm putting out there. So let me get up there and show you guys what we need to All right, do. Alright guys, I'm back up here on the ladder from, uh, from the old ground. So let me show you these expansion joints. First of all, it's from here to here. And on this end right here, all we do is we use the set screw connector application and attach it to this pipe. On this end right here, there's nothing but a float, floating area for this pipe right here as it expands and contracts through the expansion joint of the building. So right now, our EMT is sitting about right in here and it has about two inches of travel to go this way or to go this way. As the building moves, the EMT will move on us and we don't want any um, fittings to be popped out. Also, this right here of our, our braided ground keeps our, our grounds going for our continuous ground on our conduit so that we don't have any break in the system. Um, that's very important on this uh, hospital application. That we don't that all of these conduits stay grounded so that's just a real quick and dirty on these expansion joints that everybody's been um, asking about on instagram and if you want give me a follow and, and that's all i got for you today so as always stay safe out there and if you like what you see give me a thumbs up